What's up, y'all? This is Daniel. And this your boy, Damo. Oh, oh. And this your boy, Levante. And this is the Born Leader Wrestling Podcast. Uh, nigga news. Nigga news. Nigga news. Nigga news. Nigga olds. Nigga, nigga, nigga. So, Mercedes is kind of upset kinda. with Megan and Stallion. So, Mercedes oh, met, she met uh, Megan at Crunchyroll Anime uh, Awards in Japan. Yeah. So, when they met, they talked about doing shit at AEW. Yeah. And Mercedes' manager started um, doing, like, business with Ma- Megan manager from Rock Nation. Mm-hmm. And they was in the talks of doing some kind of either match or a walkout or something. Yeah, Megan. yeah. So, when she heard that Megan secured a, <laughs> a song with WWE, they're saying, like, basically everything is off the table with Mercedes. They was they was getting close to having a deal, and all of a sudden she got a song with WWE, a licensed song with WWE, and that's surprising to to um, Mercedes. So make what, it do her own shit. So what the world is the, the world is coming out with? You know, Twitter they do like they research. They're saying that the only reason why WWE got the Megan Thee Stallion track is because Mercedes was bragging online saying that she's getting a deal. Yeah. She's getting a deal done with, with Megan and to do some it. kind of shit. <laughs> and they cut that yeah, deal. Like, uh-uh. <laughs> Fuck that. Go get yeah. Lotto. Yeah. Go get Lotto. Attention, people. We need Lotto in motherfucking AEW. Okay, so. Give me Lotto. Y'all know I love Lotto. Y'all, that's my baby. That's like my Bianca of wrestling. But when it comes to worldwide, like, Megan, the only way you beating Megan is well, if really? you going, no, if you going yeah. Nikki or you going Cardi. No, the no. fuck. You you get stop. Stop. No. Stop. This shit. Y'all got to stop thinking like just stop, in a nigga, nigga world. You, nigga, you think Megan, like this, Megan this, this is big. So, so you saying, so you saying Lotto is bigger than Megan yes. in the world? Yes. In global? Yes. Get the fuck out of here. You get the fuck out of here. You're crazy. Put it on the flow, nigga. Uh, let's let's just go by <laughs> something simple. Go by simple. What you want to go by? Let's see how many followers Megan got. See how many followers. What's her name? Stallion? The Stallion? Nah, I don't fucking know. I don't follow the bitch. Yeah, see, so you're a Megan hater. I, I like Megan, but bro, you gonna Megan make- has thirty two point five million All right. followers. All right, for sure. How many of them bots? <laughs> Why would Megan need bots? The nigga, she she just got busted for bots. Like I don't I don't think she <laughs> she got busted. She got busted <laughs> for bots. And Lotto got twelve million. Yeah. So how many what? Thirty five and twelve million. Okay. That's just off of that's just off of followers off of Instagram. All I'm saying is. Megan is a bigger star. Bro. Nikki has two hundred and twenty-seven million. So you saying that Nikki is uh, Megan is a bigger uh, a bigger star than Nikki? Are yeah. you saying Lotto is a bigger star than Nikki? I'm saying, as of right now in this present day, see, and this is this is one thing. This is one thing we can't. Yeah, do. Shit, you go tell them go get Taylor Swift. No, this is one see, thing, this that's one, different. This, uh, yeah, this, this is one thing we can't do as niggas. We can't put these. Together against each other because they all friends, right? We're not putting them against each other. Let me finish. <laughs> <laughs> you saying one is bigger than the other? And that's no, a damn I'm lie. saying, I'm saying with Megan. When I go and ask you, I go ask you. Give me a Megan song. Body Adi. <laughs> give me a Lotto song. I just like the way she looked. I don't put it on the flow, nigga. Nigga, I just said it. Nigga, put it on the flow. Nigga went crazy. This and this, this, this and fucking what you call it. Like at the end of the day, you we we talking about start as of right now. You got you got you got Lotto. Go get Lotto. You, it's no way that you listen. I don't care how bad how much you want to argue this argument. I don't even I don't think you think Lotto as bad as you say she is, but it's cool. I'm talking about star star power. Star I'm talking about star power. Megan the Stallion is all around bigger. We're not talking about like who raps the better, who got the best lyricists. Yeah. Star power. Megan People that knows her. Megan the Stallion is a bigger star than Lotto. You're crazy. Lotto is probably on the same level as like a Glorilla as a Megan is Megan is up there with a with a Nikki and a Cardi. Then you have You're the second crazy. tier. The second tier is like the Glorillas, the Sexy Reds, the Lottos. 
Be crazy. That's second tier, bro. I don't care what you. If you a hip hop head and you watching this, I ain't even going. Bro, you, bro, bro. You talk, like let's be real, like you're crazy because like, like, you like, like go Nikki. get Lotto. Like that's an even thing, bro. No, you got to get Nikki. You got to get Cardi. That's the only way you even. Well, it out. I, I will tell you this: that that Glow Rilla is is under making. I will tell you that. Sure, I agree with that. Second tier. I I read uh, probably third tier. If I, I don't know. Uh, I'm not gonna argue that, but I'm saying she's. I'm saying I'm arguing a lot of it's not on the same tier as Megan. Sorry. Your argument sucks. No, my argument's right. No, uh, it's not, bro. Like, but it like if she wanted. To what go, do you think? He don't think nothing. No hey, 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 real talk. <laughs> hey, I say, fuck Lotto and Meg. You know who you get? Oh, this nigga, never mind. No, no, you know who you get for real? Scarlet nigga. Who? Yeah, Scarlet. Yeah. Him. Hell yeah. <laughs> get the fuck out of New York. Yeah, get the fuck out of this conversation. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. You don't want to brought the nigga in the conversation. Yeah. Nigga. You get her or I or like Scarlet though. She can rap. Yeah, like no, nah, but she's too aggressive. As but no, but don't you already got a, a theme with sexy red? If you gonna do a fucking theme song, you should have used. You sexy can't red. do sexy red. I'm sorry. If they was bash smack down, bitch. <laughs> yeah, no, nah, we can't do that one. No, but what I'm saying like any other well, would have been good. Any of them, anybody. They all got to me. They all got the status of. Women rapping, they all got their own popularity, dog. Megan, like you said, Megan is the biggest out of all of them right now, so that's why they showed Megan the Stallion. But if they did, Lotto could have fit in too. People know Lotto. She don't have that star power though. I'm, I'm just bring me out the plastic. Yeah, I'm racking brand new. You know what I'm saying, <laughs> imagine that fucking show smack down. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you would just use that that yeah. part yeah. for the intro. You know what I'm saying, we acting brand new with a new logo. That's an old ass song for one. Then, right, well, I'm not paying for that old ass song. I didn't have, I didn't have Jay. You didn't pay for the new song, yeah. nigga. WWE, I'm saying. I'm not paying for old ass now, song. I, I will say Big for Jay and, and, and Bianca's uh, tattoo Mama. song, you get like a sexy rest of body for, for their theme song. Yeah, you get a theme song, yeah. yeah. But not yeah. a not an like opening. Sexy somebody for their theme song. You can make it for a theme song. Um, one, two, three, four. It's a storm coming. ESD, bitch. <laughs> AEW fans are slamming. Um, AEW for making this world championship hoodie design. It's trash. They want a hundred dollars for this trash ass hoodie. Uh, I'll yo, put it down here and yo, y'all. Just they see. want seven hundred for a title. Yeah, they they. Bro, it's like nigga, the, the prices ain't right. Um, Mercedes Monet admits that the Daniel Bryan scene of him getting like choked out with the bag was hard to watch. It was. Even she admits it. Like that was. It she was said she good. doesn't. As wrestling fans and like grown ups, like sometimes you can watch stuff like that, but she wouldn't want her kid, or her, her she wouldn't want her little brother or kids watching. I told y'all last week, we saw Big Boss Man get hanged. That wasn't cool either. But we yeah. saw it though. But that was attitude there. It's but, different we, but it don't matter. It's wrestling. It, it, it it's wrestling. Cool we saw uh, Boss Man feed I Snow a fucking dog. We saw Triple H fucking dead body. And y'all making a nigga got shot out of plastic? Rip it out, nigga. Be brand new, nigga. <laughs> what the fuck, nigga. You get shot, nigga. You got you know, rip that shit, nigga. What the fuck is wrong with you? The reason why I'm making this nigga stupid, he didn't think about that shit. Punk the whole bitch. What the fuck wrong with you? Punk the whole bitch. And everybody get a man. Oh, he get shot. No, he's dumb. Cause he's so dumb and so like eco friendly. I would have said the plastic. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> plastic lights matter. Yeah. Oh no, it's the plastic, but I don't want to rip it because it's damaging hey, it. Boss man, shit was disturbing because that really was a fucking noose, nigga. That wasn't just nigga. That was a plastic bag, nigga. Yeah. That was a plastic. You know what I'm saying. Bag. But I don't know from what store though, but it was a plastic. <laughs> Food for less. Nah, nah, nah. This nigga sh- John Moxley, whatever <laughs> shit he owned, though, I fuck with. Yo, we saw a syringe. We saw a staple. And y'all tripped about a plastic fucking bag? I think it's because it was the end of the night. It was like, we seen all that shit. Now we seeing this. And y'all just had a death match, what, a couple of months ago? And y'all worried about this fucking shit? Hey, I low key. But I, I think that's why people are mad because this is too much constantly. Like, so if, y'all you do it, if you do it every now and then, it's cool. But sometimes, like she was saying, if it don't make sense, then why do it? I think we already had like all the blood and all the shit that we needed on a death match, and now you bringing this nigga that could actually wrestle and could tell a story in the ring. Now you want to get this nigga choke this nigga with I a bag? Think, I, okay, because I'm not gonna agree with what you said, but I am gonna say this: the it, the bag was was disturbing because like nigga, the nigga really looked like he was dying. Like if if, if anything. 
I don't even know if the nigga had a like a signal. He didn't give a signal or nothing. That nigga stop, yeah. bitch, huh? Yeah, I say yeah. That, that shit did look nasty. It looked yeah. nasty, but I don't agree that. Oh, what I just believe that it just looked like you killed the nigga on TV, and it's I guess that's what it was supposed to portray. Mm-hmm. But that's what it looked like. You killed the nigga on TV. Same thing with you talking about with the boss man shit. Yo, that nigga they didn't bring out like a cord and wrap Chad around. Chad Gable had a bullet to his head, nigga. <laughs> you saw you saw the shit on the side, nigga. Yeah, but it was like you didn't see a nigga pull a trigger. But nigga, like. but y'all made us believe, nigga, he got shot. But a lot of people saying like it's it's kind of hard for them to get any kind of like real TV deals and somebody like to really give them some. But it's like all this shit they doing. How can you? How can you basically have sponsorships with commercials and you doing shit like that? And they I just, said it's the pay per view though. They put him in a plastic bag and show a full flush commercial. <laughs> Huh? But no, they fucked up last time. Remember they did, so they doing this on pay per view, which is cool because you have to pay fifty dollars for that. So you should be able to do what the fuck you want to do on your pay per views. But when it comes to like your TV shit, I remember they had the little Papa John's or whatever Domino's yeah. commercial, and they end up like Jericho end up cutting a nigga with the with the, with with the, the, the slices. Yeah, yeah, and they got in trouble for that. They lost a, a lot of sponsorships for that. They lost Domino's and they lost some other shit. I think we do not think these sponsorships should do. Should stop being whores. I'm just saying. That's what sponsorships do. Be horse. Yeah. Yeah, you just stop. That's how you get money. Man. <laughs> no, no, but sponsor like it, Nigga, it, you it, see what's the name of all that shit that you be doing? What? That shit is everywhere. Fucking um prize pick or prize, whatever shit yeah. got. They horse. But I'm not saying whores as far as like that. I'm saying hold on, bro. Like <laughs> yeah, no, I'm no. saying stop being whores as far as like like because you think cause, yeah, we insensitive to shit. Like, don't get me wrong, nigga. We all grew up. In the attitude era, we all was looking for AEW in the attitude era, and we couldn't get the AEW. The same people that's a CEO like that shit, bro. You just trying to be censorship for the little white lady that's in, in 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 Kansas. But I think censorship. I think the people nowadays they fucked it up with the cancer cancer culture shit. But you cancer culture go back sucks. to that. You can't but you can't do shit. Then, then push them off. They don't watch this shit no more because, yo, they go in there. It's gonna be violent. It's gonna be wrestling. But as a sponsor, you don't. If you telling people to leave, that you losing money. <laughs> you losing money, but, but at, the end, ta- at the end of the day, you know what the, the the fucked up thing is. Eventually, you have to make a stand. If you are gonna go this route and it's getting you the viewership, then let the ones ones to leave. And once they come back, they're just gonna pay a premium. But that's what it is. If if the rating is there, if the numbers are there, they're going to go. Nigga, fucking criminal minds is on TV every fucking week, and they do some disturbing shit yeah. every. Fucking weak, and they get high ratings. And, like and high ratings, and they got Papa Joms, Christian Mingle, and every fucking thing around mm-hmm. the motherfucker. Yeah. So you got to make a choice whether you're gonna be, have your mission or have your mission, or say I'm just gonna be whatever. But you, want. I, you're going to the company is going to lose eventually doing that because no, 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 no. I'm saying so so that the company is going to lose because it's so many times you can say. Tell the tell sponsorship to, oh, we're going to do this. Or if you leave, then leave. Then if so many leave, you're not getting money. If your ratings are rating me. <laughs> they don't matter. I'm, no, it does. They don't. It, Criminal Mind talks about. I'm scrolling. Well, you took my bad. Yeah, I don't know. Please look back. Yeah. Every week, they talk about for serial killers. They got all this. Jeffrey Dahmer was the biggest fucking show on Netflix. Nigga, we could go through the thing about people sit there and write these scripts and put them out, and they got all the sponsorships in the fucking world. They're not stripping nothing. Yeah, that's a, that's a, even though it's a TV show and movie, we, they, they selling it as this is a movie. Rest in the sentence that this is a TV show and little kids watch it. If your little kid is watching Jeffrey Dahmer, that's on you. It's a different. It's a different audience. But they watch anime. There's 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 moments in wrestling where yeah, it's going to make you think, oh shit, this shit is real, and that's what they want you to think. This shit is real, but it's fake. So it may look real, even though it could be actually real. They know I'm not about to kill this nigga. I it's just the image of me fucking yeah, you Yeah, I understand up. both, but I'm saying if I, I'm speaking from, if I'm a sponsor, you keep saying like, yes, Criminal Mind Show, this, this, and yeah. this, and this, and this. Okay, if you're a sponsor, right, and you this show could get 500 million sh- views every single week, but if they're showing something that's 
human, like if they showing something that's disgusting that you don't agree with in your life, your morals, you, some people is like, I don't give a fuck how many views you're showing. I'm not about to put my product behind this. Yeah, you're right. Some people. So it's a lot of people that's like that. You know, but there's a lot more people. It's, there's a lot more people in this world that we look at because this world is a statistic-based world all of a fucking sudden. A statistic-based world where they go and look and they say, oh, the numbers is right. I'm going to go give there because they, they getting this many views. I'm going to do that. I'm putting that over there. At the end of the it's, day, yeah, it's different people in different worlds. Yeah. Different, different I wouldn't that. do it. Yeah, that's that, cool. Because at the end of the day, if something went... For example, if you put your sponsorship all into Diddy's parties, and now that shit backfired now, now nigga, for forty years you was popping. Yeah, but now, <laughs> hey, but that forty years you popping, but one, then, but one, one incident take all that shit away. Know. Now you in court with this nigga. You're right. Let me break. Let me, I'm just saying, you said court, two different things, two different things. It's not two different things. It I'm saying it's completely you, it's, two yo, different things. Yo, Hold all on. it is is just look. When it comes to violence and sponsorships, yeah, they they, they do got to say so. But when you're doing scripted wrestling and shit, they know that they sh- they should realize that it's just for that day and it's still entertaining. But how long? So so because even if it was like a Halloween episode, right? And you have monsters running out. Uh-huh. Kids are scared, scared of monsters, right? So that kids, would, oh my god, a monsters on TV. But how far do you push it? Because now it's like we got. It's like now it's like all right, we 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 gave you the thing where you last year you drunk the nigga blood. Yeah, you did this, you did that. Okay, now this year you got syringes, and now you now you oh, to now, the you, Emmy, yeah. now you cho- now you uh, got a plastic bag choking the nigga out. All right, I'm sticking I'm sticking with you. Let next year you go have a fucking go back to days when uh what's name had the gun and about to shoot like shoot Stone yeah. Cold. Like when do we stop? Are we gonna stop? Before, are we gonna oh, stop too late? Let me tell you something. Bro. I'm just saying. I'm gonna tell you something, bro. Every we year it gets we literally had dark ma- and dark. We literally had. Buried alive matches. We literally had cats in matches. They literally hang boss man on motherfucking rock. You keep going to we the boss man no, shit. No, cats no, okay. matches. Kane put jumper cables to shake my man nuts. Right. That's like, disturbing. You literally go on, we literally could go and say all this shit. At the end of the day, it was still, you still, long as you got the viewership, people are going and to And y'all go going back to that. Can no, we go to no. something from two years and up or three years and up or four years and up? Y'all yeah. going back to when niggas no. didn't give a fuck about cancer. No. We're talking about now. These days, no. it's different. But, the, but Y'all keep going back but, to the attitude. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Every day. I think, I think that's what it is. People are, are diving into the fact that it's different now, right? But when it comes to you put out your product, you got to go against that shit. It's not different. It's still wrestling. No, hey. because WWE is not doing fucking shit like that every. I, you can do it. I understand. Yeah. You can do it every now and then, but for you to do it three times in one night, like that's you overdoing it now. That was one night. It was three, three episodes. times in one night. It's three. not three episodes. It's one night. No, three different matches in one night. Yeah, that's, that's you're one doing episode a lot. in six months. I'm saying you're doing a lot back to back, and we, we that's just one night. They did other shit. What Aiden, was shit called Blood and Guts? Blood, no, we, that was all out. Yeah. Blood and Guts is a whole different yeah. thing. Well, That's what I'm saying. So it's like, one thing I'm, I'm, I'm trying to say is, yeah, it, it is kind of extreme, but... Extreme! <laughs> but, See, we're not going to get a spot. Shit. We did that shit. When it, <laughs> when it comes down to it, if it's going to lead to something or get a reaction, I say do it. That's yeah, that's different. If if because we all look, we're reacting to a motherfucker in a fucking garbage bag. You know what I'm saying? It's good, but it's bad when your own people and it's not just Mercedes. It was other people in the company that said the same thing. Like that wasn't cool. But they still working there, right? I mean, they get a paycheck. Okay, so they but when your own but when your own people in your own company is talking bad about you on to to the world, yeah, in public, that makes the company look bad. Well, and it doesn't make the company look bad. It makes the people over the company that's looking like, if these niggas that's working here every week saying shit about the company, why should I take my dollars and put into this company? That's what I'm saying. But I'm going to tell you this. I'm going to tell you this. Yo, you got to think like the big you picture. You're talking about a company that literally don't have a, a, a lot of ratings already. And if they feel, if, if you doing stuff to, to get your ratings up and to keep to and, keep TV shows going, you have to do what you got to do. And now, if it comes with you getting your ratings up, if your ratings are up, we're not talking about this at all. I think since then, they they at 700,000 now. Their ratings are <laughs> up. Their, their ratings, I mean, if you put them against WWE, they're not up. But if you put them but, against other shows, them, they're up. For them. Against themselves. Yeah, they're growing. And after that episode, after that shit, there's 700,000. 
Before they're in the six and in the five. Yeah, but then it's like it's seven hundred thousand the next night that we want to see what's gonna happen and then it drops back to six because you don't have consistency. Well, we t- I mean, that's why I say if if this is gonna get your right, if you if you're gonna go this way, if you're gonna go the AEW route, if you're gonna go no. these certain certain different routes or whatever, and you maintain it, you're going to get that sponsor, you're going to go get what you want to go want to get. Nigga, it's just gonna be determined who the fuck is gonna Papa John's might not be might not be cool with it. Little Caesars might be. Who gives a fuck? Do okay. what you gotta do. What was your opinion when you saw old boy burn down the house? That was cool. Why? Because of the storyline. Yeah, but you burnt down somebody's house. But you could tell it was fake. No, bro. See that? See that's no. You could burning down somebody's house and sitting crazy. in front of it. Like with a beer, it's like that's like a TV show. Okay, okay. Shit. Now, but you actually okay. running out and ch- look. Okay, I'm not. You, say, I'm not. You, I'm not you. talking okay, bad no, about no, it. No, I'm saying. Imagine this. the little kids watching that. They just seen the house burn. Seen it burn there, right? Yeah. But an actual kid that looks up to Daniel Bryan, seeing him getting choked out with a bat. Actual kid look up to Swerve or look up to the other nigga that said, "Oh, I don't like that boy at school," and I burn the fucking house, his house down. Nigga, we talk. We can say the same shit no, no. matter what the fuck so, you say. My argument is this. It's going to go there. It's going to go there. And I feel like it's not the entertainment that we're used to, but they cannot be like the WWE. They can't do like the the uh, the PG shit. I'm not, they got it up the ante. I'm not saying don't do the PG shit. I'm saying do the shit that you're doing, but don't do it constantly every single week. Because once you do once you do that one week, yeah. what you going to do the next week they to follow like, that up? But that's the thing, though. That's the why you got to tune in because you're not going to know what's going to happen. And no. that's how you bring in viewership. But they like, do it. They got cinder blocks. They got they got barbed wire. They got staple guns. They got shit that is not in WWE. So I'm going to watch AEW because somebody gets And their viewership kicked. is still down. Huh? Their viewership is still down after doing all that. Compared, no, you're compared, consistent. Compared to WWE, yes. We're not, I'm not no, never but, comparing yeah, to yeah, WWE. Yeah. But to <laughs> compare them to... Another show, or another situation. They are I have a consistent viewership. They don't have a consistent viewership. That's what the are you thing. About? They have a viewership when they do shit like that. That, that was a pay per view, so I'm not gonna yeah, count yeah, that. It's yeah. a pay per view. We're talking about week to week shows. They do not have a consistent. They do not. They do not hit 600 every single time or 700 every single time. The last time they had 700 to almost 800 is when they showed CM Punk backstage fight, and then the shit dropped right back down to like uh, five or six. They do not have consistency every week. That was a pay-per-view that we're talking about all out. Yeah, you had to pay yeah. $50 for. The last time they had a big number after this, the um, CM Punk shit was Blood and Guts. That's kind of like a quote-unquote pay-per-view uh, dynamite. That's when they had the Hell in the Cell and the tag team match and they bleed and chair shots and blah, blah, blah. When they have shit like that, their ratings is up. After that, it drops back down. You're right. Y'all ask a question? Like, if we really go and look at certain shit that's on TV all the time. Um, Young and Restless. Right, here's a TV show forever. Mm-hmm. Are they getting the same? They getting they getting five hundred? What is it? Five hundred thousand? Five hundred? What is, what was the numbers like? Are they getting five hundred? Are they getting less? It shows us on TV consistently. It's getting less than what AEW is getting from. Young wrestlers are doing more than AEW. I'm, I'm, you, but I mean, you I'm, could try you, to compare. For an example, no, you don't use that. Use it to somebody you compare to. Like, right, use the younger a, anything on BET. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Friday get more. Friday get more than um, who? Friday the movie get more than. Of course, <laughs> all right then. No, nigga. not no more. Not, not no more. But nigga, you uh, talking about they ratings are like you talking about like. A lot of these shows, my phone, dog, I can't even look. Y'all spend too much time on AEW. Yeah, hey, no, I'm you done just, with it. Just, <laughs> I'm just saying, like, hey, I, I don't mind seeing the Tinder block if somebody gets choked out. Right. Well, that shit. Um, Britt Baker and Adam Cole, they, quote unquote, they, they're not Broke together up. no more. Yeah. They haven't announced it, but the word is saying that. Um, Adam Cole. Adam Cole. Yeah. Bay Bay. Bay Bay. Athena is the longest running. Women, uh, RH Women's Champion. She's oh my God, man! Six hundred and forty-six days so Let's far. Let's go. Um, WWE news. She not even. Sexy Red is making a return. Oh, get October eighth and Stick and then um, don't that bitch a tear. St. Louis, uh, 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 her hometown. Uh, uh, she could be out there with Randy. Yep. 
What them motherfuckers be? They, they as soon as hey, that song come on the club, a double be... a double RKO. I see it coming. <laughs> I see a double funny. RKO. I hope so. Hey, I, for so, I don't know how this happened, but he go Randy Orton facing the young OG. Hell yeah! I didn't see how that happened. I just seen him like they make the match. Yeah, that, I, was gonna, I was gonna buy the young OG shirt too, but that shit was high as a motherfucker. Too. Hey, that hey, that's good for the um, for the young OG. Yeah, well, yeah. now he gonna be the legend killer and the young nigga killer after this match. <laughs> hey. The way how he going to set that RKO going to be crazy. <laughs> For real. That nigga might do a backflip or some <laughs> shit. Uh, w- uh-huh. No, no, go ahead. WWE released the Global Superstar Pack today, which has, oh, I have my list, Jay Cargill, um, Nia Jax, Michelle McCool, Carlito, Kyrie Sane, Dragon Lee, and your homegirl, L- Laura. I can't never say her name. Uh, Lyra. Uh, Lyra. Vakara. Lyra, yeah. I bought yeah. it. Oh, you got it? Yeah. Cap. I bought it. Cap. Nigga capping. Ain't lying like mother. I bought it. Nigga, post it on post it on Instagram. Show it's real. You might say some you might you said earlier you, that she got some fake fake bots. Megan Thee Stallion, WWE SmackDown thing never pays. Top the digital sale charts today. She has bots. All right, maybe I don't know about that one. But I don't know about that. But I know it came article came out today that her album was about it. Or album. I'm about to say, because maybe WWE fans ran to the song and wanted to hear the whole song. Yeah, I don't know about the song, but I know that um, her album was about it, and it was reportedly so many hundreds of thousands of millions of fucking shit about it. It made me think I'm doing something wrong. I need to bop my motherfucker. <laughs> For hey, real. Bop that shit up. <laughs> <laughs> bite it, bite it, bite it, bite it. <laughs> motherfucker got a world tour off of botting some shit. I need to go bop me some shit. I'm about to go bop some shit too. Because shit. But no, shout out to Megan. Now you want to shout out. Uh, I, 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 I can have a critique and not like something and still like the person. No, you can't. <laughs> don't, don't project your shit on me <laughs> Sheamus uh, resigns a new WWE contract Don't know why like, But okay He just resigned his new 24 hour fitness contract. <laughs> That fucked up Rhea Ripley credits the judgment day For her um, boosting her WWE success Yeah definitely That's a fact She should have Hell yeah So we all knew this was gonna happen I know you gonna hate But it's, it's, it's common WWE Smackdown The first uh, episode on USA Network, it was down, so it had it hits a, it hit a hundred no a hundred sorry it hit one point seven million, so it's down from when Fox when it was on Fox it was at two point three. And before I ask why, I'm gonna ask you: Do you think do you know why it's down? It's because it's Swish. Oh, okay, thank you. I thought you go to some hating shit. No, they yeah. so I so they it, it's down because it was on channel eleven, which is local TV, mm-hmm. and anybody can watch it. Now that people that don't have cable, they can't watch it. So of course it's down. But they still say that's a high number for it to be on for USA switch. Network. It's, it's, yeah. it's a switch. Every time they do a switch, it ends up like that. Even when they went to fucking Fox Sports Net for a minute, it, it, it the numbers was down. You're going to get the numbers down for the minute because at the end of the day, when we was kids and we was watching, it went from USA to Spike. Nigga, we didn't know what the fuck Spike yeah, you was. You had to go we find thought, Spike. Huh? You had to go find the shit. You had to go find the shit. And sometimes you didn't find the motherfucker. Even when they went to, I think they went to TNN for and a TNN, little bit. Yeah. yeah. All this shit. We, we couldn't find the shit. So... No, that's just the whole thing. It's just because of Switch. You give it about give it about four weeks, you'll be back where it was supposed to be. Um, WWE runs less live events in 2025, says that. That TKO sense. president. That's cool, though. The TKO president said that um, WWE live events cost too much, and it doesn't make that much money back. Like, basically, because you got to travel with all, everybody got to travel there. They got to put the trucks and all that shit setting the ring up. So it yeah. doesn't really make I, sense, and the superstar can take a break. That's going to hurt wrestling. It's gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt wrestlers, or the wrestlers that's not always on the main show. If if that was a they generate like the party girls, right? Mm. For example, we don't get the party girls on the main show pretty much ever, but they did house shows. They did house shows, and if they're not performing house shows, are you just are you still gonna pay them their money for getting house shows, or are you just gonna how are you gonna work that out with them? You probably you probably incorporate that. With the actual show, like let's say they get there early, they might have like an early show and they go to the main show. But even when you get there early, you only get two matches before the shows. Hey, like that—that's a fucking house show. But it's like 
No, house shows, this nigga be like five, six, seven shows yeah, sometimes. But okay, so you cut that in half, but you would still get the extra matches if you get there early enough. But this is when this is when a major company takes away um a part that does right by the workers and go right by the fans. Yeah, because they want to cut costs. Because you're going to cut costs. Yeah. And the cutting cost shit, it, it, it's going to hurt. The tickets for the main show is going to go up. Like SmackDown Hell and yeah. Raw is going up. Mooski just hit me and said that um, he was going to go to the one in the Raw and um, out there in Ontario. Mm-hmm. He said damn the prices was the same that he paid in WrestleMania for a fucking Raw. Yeah, the yeah. prices is going up no matter how you look at it. But taking away the house shows is like, what you taking away the house shows? Do you still pay those wrestlers? Like, I don't think so. Like, I think the the main roster people, I mean the main people, they love it because they get more days off. Yeah, they still but the one that's trying to make a name of it for themselves to get that shit. Yeah, they get fucked up. Gonna cut out. Yeah, yeah. Now they got to now think about this. Like, I'm I'm not we going. You know, I deep dive and search it, and my mind just run where it runs. They get house shows is typically practice, mm. right? So now they're not practicing. They got to go find a gym if they're not nowhere near. The, they don't live near the performance center. They got to go find a gym and go practice over there. On top of that, they're not getting paid. They got to spend their own motherfucking money. Like, is they getting a check for this shit? Like, what's going well, on? I, I think at that point, then, like, if you don't see yourself, you know, getting that time on TV and wrestling shit, you go find another an, an, another thing to do. You, the, the different promotion that you get into. But you can't. But then you can't. That was advocate. For years, these wrestlers have been saying, oh, my God, WWE schedule is so bad. Yeah. It's 255 days out the year, blah, mm-hmm. blah, blah. So it's like, all right, now y'all can stay home with your family longer. Yeah. Like, we cutting days. So it's like, now it's like, damn, but y'all cutting the days. I need to pay. Like, it's like you can't But, both. It is, but it is, we don't know the contract. They can still begin to pay the same amount of money that they had home. I mean, that's the why all yeah. the, I ask the question, like, how do they compensate yeah. them? But, or they cut it in half, at yeah, least. You know? But... The main wrestlers is saying that. Yeah. The ones like Cesario. Yeah. Like, yeah. like, like, we, we them, they, they like, nigga, I'm about to go get this little bag and do a flippity flip over yeah. the fucking day. Yeah. Like, the main wrestler, Ric Flair is definitely saying it's too much. Booker T is saying it's too much. Like, we could go down the list, but the ones that's not like Shotzi, like, that's all she was making her living off of was the fucking house shows. Yeah. And then the, really, you want to really deep dive the motherfucker that's setting the rings up and shit. Because <laughs> like, yeah, now they should just cut to like Monday and t- Friday. Like, yeah. But I mean, they not get rid of it all. They just cutting down some days. They didn't say but, how many days. Yeah. But. They be all right. They survive. Um, now, what it, if what it would do if 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 they cut down, they allow the, some of their lower level wrestlers to go do an independent spot here and there? They be doing that. Yeah. That'd be cool. Yeah. They, they did that with um. You know, get them time to go do some more meet and greets and all that shit. Well, yeah, you got to compliment that some yeah. kind of way. Because they got to deal with um cricket wireless and they do stuff yeah. like that. Yeah, and fucking. Uh, they could come to Born the Wrestling they, podcast they, they now. For real. You know what I'm saying the fanatic. They need an LA fanatic. We that shit used to, that shit licked it lit. Oh yeah. Hey, York. I want to do this shit where they you know the interest. Yeah, that shit I was tight. Shit. Yeah. Come out there to some fucking Norman Smiley. Or some Al, some Al Snow. <laughs> they even still that and shit. <laughs> I bring my fucking phone. <laughs> Plug it up to the <laughs> shit. I'll pay, my, I'll pay my <laughs> money. Uh, Dominic was still, Ray was still spotted at UFC 305, 306. Yeah. And Ray was still actually gave a gift to, I think it was Dana White, I believe. Yeah. Gave him a Dana mask. Dana, that woman beat her. <laughs> he gave him his mask. They got a close relationship. Shit. Say we both beating bitches. No, you trying to put that on Ray. Oh, my bad. I, yeah, I, man, that's, that's fucked up. Vince. Hey, I didn't say <laughs> Vince. Is like, hey, I didn't say we don't even see. We, we don't even know Vince. See, you just putting yeah. shit on niggas. Yeah. Now, now we know he did it. We just don't care. Now you putting shit on Vince. You a snitch ass nigga. The only thing Vince beat <laughs> up is the pussy. Yeah. Hey, what you do? What? I'm gonna tell on your ass next. <laughs> Damn this nigga. <laughs> uh, NXT, uh, NXT. My bad. Netflix. Mm-hmm. They confirmed that it is gonna be commercials on Raw. Yeah. So I'm guessing you are gonna have to get the premium, premium. And I checked the actual because you know the Vince Man documentary is coming out next week, I believe. Twenty eighth. So I even checked Netflix. So I'm like, all right, I gotta get Netflix now. Because also, what's the name was on there? No, what's 
that shit called that yeah, I like. It ain't even wrestling. What's that shit called? All America. All America's on there. So I look. If you want the basic shit with just 1080p and like two chan or two TVs or some shit, they say it was like six ninety nine, but it come with a game commercials. Yeah. Then nigga, that, that motherfucker don't jump to ten. That shit jump to sixteen. Yeah. That don't come with that. I think that you get like still two channels, but it's like you get no commercials. Then they got something like twenty five dollars when you get like four K and all this bullshit. I'm like, I'm not paying twenty five dollars a month. So I'm gonna try this those six first and see. I don't hate yeah, commercials. You ain't gonna like this. Yeah, but nigga, yeah, you be watching. You be watching. I was watching Baby Boy with that shit. Uh, that motherfucker, right when she was like, he was like, "Yo, get in there and make some taco." I'm a, here it is Wolf Star. <laughs> like it is like, but damn, da, nigga, da, 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 da. I'm like, I'm not gonna watch the show on, 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 on Tubi. On Tubi, yeah. <laughs> but fifteen ninety nine, and you ain't even giving me four K. You still give me ten eighty. No, I think the seven ninety nine, the six ninety nine, come with seven twenty p. Oh, hell and then, no. the, and then the, the fifteen dollar one come with ten eighty p with no commercials. Man, look, I pay for it. I, I pay damn near twenty dollars. So. Yeah, see, I ain't doing that with Netflix. I don't watch Netflix like that. I do. I watch that shit at work. <laughs> <laughs> Netflix ain't getting twenty. If Peacock is only getting what twelve, Netflix get ain't getting no Peacock twenty. Get canceled like a motherfucker. I need to find a female where they got Netflix, but they got that shit where it's like if you share your shit. They cut it off. It's yeah. like certain you can, shit. You, you, okay, you can share your account, but you cannot, like, be on the same account. With, like, three different, different. Like, you can't be under. If I give you my account, you uh, can't be on my name at your house. You got to be under. The same Wi-Fi type shit or something? Name. Like. Yeah, that shit dumb as fuck, bro. Because you got it in the household. Like, I got, like, five people in my on my account, like. And they just use it from different rooms. Nigga, yeah. I canceled that shit when before because that motherfucker hit me for like thirty. I mean, I'm like, what the fuck? Is you yeah, talking Netflix, about? y'all ain't got that much shit on there. Talking some twenty something at all. Yeah. Um, I Peacock just for the PLEs. Nigga, that's why I, I'm about to cancel nah, nigga, that Lord, shit. Nah, nigga, my shit coming back. Law and Order, Chicago PD, Chicago, trauma, all that shit, nigga. Trauma. Them motherfuckers on TV talking about killing and, 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 and graping motherfuckers. Damn, but, nigga, I got to blank that shit again. I said grape. I said grape. <laughs> I said grape. <laughs> Uh, Dominic. Uh, people are comparing Dominic Hill's character to MJF. No. What you mean? No. There's no comparison. I mean, they can compare the shit, but I don't. It, it doesn't compare to me. You, who's better? Uh, MJF in the beginning. This MJF trash. Yeah, uh, I'll go with it. I agree with that. Dominic, Dominic is just, he's in kind of in the lane he's of his consistent, own. He's consistent, dog. He's, he's in the lane of his own. Yeah. He eventually going to have to make a stand about something. And, you know, he's going to have to turn He's going to turn into, like, the Joker. Like, start doing, he had to come with sneak attacks or some shit. Okay. I don't know. Dominic White must have set that nigga down and said, look, you can you do all. You better stop kissing that yeah, bitch on now, camera. Yeah. Now they got to do the no yeah. shit. Yeah. <laughs> look. Yeah, she's like, you get you got one kiss a year. You already use it, nigga. Now y'all can do a little nose kissy shit, a little nose touch shit. That's it. Nigga, then you better not grab her ass again. <laughs> that was me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, last <laughs> last thing on the nigga news, and this is crazy. <laughs> Val Venus, this nigga, he said, Val Venus said he's not surprised by Power Hungry Triple H because he allegedly was attending. And it's a picture. He attended the Diddy party. Who did? <laughs> Triple H. Oh shit! So Velveeta said Triple H, Triple H, Vince, and and Stephanie, all of them attended the Diddy party. Now, I believe oh it. shit! Now it I is it. it is a picture out. It is not at Diddy's party, but it is a picture out there with all three of them taking a picture. It was it was like I don't know if it was at WrestleMania something. I don't know if it was a wrestling event, but it was in the house. But Velveeta's claiming that they went to the party. Oh, well, shit. I believe it because you know Diddy was on Raw and he was with the New Day and. Shit. So yeah, I believe he asked it. about Biggie Nut. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yo, hey, I believe it. He's about to go in there, y'all. <laughs> Triple H and, about to and, and, and this man was like, hey, "You got some um, baby oil, some young bitches." <laughs> <laughs> some young bitches. Like, <laughs> you think hey, he walked hey, in? Did he say, "Got to worry about nothing." Biggie and ask a little of this. Stop, stop. <laughs> You want what kind of lube you want? Strawberry? <laughs> what kind of, the, the lube strawberry is crazy. <laughs> Yo, this shit about to go crazy. The man. lube strawberry. You what kind of lube you want, Playboy? <laughs> you want strawberry? <laughs> Yeah, oh, yeah. What kind of loose shit? Like to suck on? Yo, yo, I brought, I brought Bobby Lashley. <laughs> I brought Bobby Lashley with me. 
Oh my god! Talk about the dildo. <laughs> <laughs> we know that. See, see, what the fuck? that that is see. We, we know. See, <laughs> what you talking about? <laughs> Cody Rose and all he had to do was say <laughs> the one line. That's all you had to say. <laughs> I told you. I told you. <laughs> you I told you. You didn't have to say nothing else. Point. You didn't have to say nothing else. We no. got it. <laughs> so you get it now? No. No, I don't get it. I don't want it. It was. <laughs> it was. Oh, my God. Uh, cut the shit. So <laughs> my cut the shit is going to Daniel. <laughs> my, my cut the shit is Daniel because... Um, he didn't remind me about his car. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, you jumped good. You jumped good. <laughs> hey, you told us, man. <laughs> he didn't remind me about his comedy show yet. He reminded us two weeks ago on the podcast, and then last week he didn't mention nothing about it, and it was the next day. And then I, the way, the crazy thing is the way I found out about it is I went on Mooski, the story, and Mooski is there. <laughs> Just Talk crazy, Mooski, you know what it is. So Mooski pulled up, and I didn't get, the, I didn't get no invitation. That's crazy, but yeah, you cut the shit, cut the shit, cut the shit. Yeah, cut the shit for real, nigga. You That's gonna cut crazy. The shit on me, for not inviting you. <laughs> yeah, not inviting me. No address. And, 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 oh, no address, huh? Nothing. So, so it's my fault, huh? Basically, I'm the one who didn't invite you. <laughs> nah, I'm the one who didn't tell you about my comedy show. You told me two weeks, two, two weeks, weeks ago. ago. So you was aware of the comedy show. I was aware two weeks ago. Ex- but the night before, I was supposed to remind you. Supposed to remind. I'm supposed to do your brain job. What? <laughs> I'm supposed to do what your brain's supposed to do. Is remember. <laughs> I mean, two weeks is a lot. When when oh, past? Hey. Yo. A lot of things happened in two weeks, like. Oh, so okay, so it, it was You reminded Mooski. No, I didn't. <laughs> no, I didn't. Damn. When did he call you about it? Who? About the, the uh I called him. <laughs> see? Oh, oh, you see? You see? So you called him and asked him? No, I called him. To verify. Say, I, I, cause I thought it was at the end of the month. I'm like, hey, is that the end of the month? He like, yeah, it was on Thursday. I'm like, oh, okay. But what day was that that you called him? Probably like Tuesday. Okay, so when Thursday came, you knew Thursday? That is Thursday. Oh, see. Because even uh. my, my homegirl was about to come down and go to an event, but she couldn't make it. Oh, see. Well, uh-huh. I didn't know. Yeah, yeah, it, yeah. Yeah, he didn't remind me. Uh-huh, yeah. It's he all good. He posted on Instagram, too. Boom. Yeah, it's all good, though. He posted a story or on his page? I think it was a story. Oh. Either or, nigga. Right. He tagged both of us, too. No, he did not tag us. <laughs> he did not. Now nah, nah, I know you lie. No, he tagged us after. He tagged no. us about the new. He said no. Mm-hmm. No, tagged, no, no. He, he didn't tag. I, I know. Because hey, I had to keep going. I got to go to the store to get the address. No, if he tagged yeah. us, I would have knew. He didn't, well, he didn't tag me. We definitely was tagged. Nah. And I'm looking. I'm like. I would if he would tag, No, I, I, if he would have tagged me, I would have knew then. Yeah. He tagged me after one when he was talking about some um when he was sitting in the car. And he was saying like, hey <laughs> yo, yo, this is your boy Daniel and all that. He was talking no, real no, fast. No, no, that was no, recent one. Yeah, that's hey, recent. your boy Daniel, don't forget the white <laughs> Yeah, that's the new one. Yeah. Out of monster. <laughs> yo. Oh, Energy drink or get a big E. Get a Bobby. <laughs> That's a deal, though. Bobby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. My cut is she going to your ass. <laughs> <laughs> this finger right here is the indicator right here. That a, re- a reverse uh, cut the shit. Yeah. <laughs> That's the first time. Yeah. yeah, play Uno. <laughs> <laughs> well, reverse, reverse. Yeah. Shit. One stump, one time. Oh man. Charlie Brown. <laughs> yeah, cut the shit, nigga. You already know what it is. My bad. Right. <laughs> well, I guess my cut the shit got. Do some wrestling shit. <laughs> Since y'all want to cut the shit on each other, pause. pause. Yo, nigga, you see, your my cut the is, shit <laughs> is going to Monday Night Raw as a collective in the motherfucking group. Yeah, um, that's a Bianca match. No, include that match. The, the roll ups threw me off. A lot of roll ups. Um, Luva Kaiser going there acting like 
he, oh, he was going to Sammy, beef with, yeah. Sammy ain't a thing. And he was like, then Sammy come out and talk to Gunther. I forgot about Gunther's that. still walking away. And then, uh, like, yeah, you know, I, and he closed line, fucking Sammy and fuck Sammy up. Yeah. Like, Sammy came back and did a little kick. Yeah, Huluma kick fucked him up. Gunther on the on on the thing looked like a scared ass champion. Um, yeah, he had to throw a Gunther shot in there before the end of the show yeah. for sure. <laughs> um, but Raw was kind of I, I I thought when Luva Kaiser came in, I thought that he was going to take over the seat the the general manager role, and I would love to see Luva Kaiser the general manager of Raw and Gunther be the champion. It will make sense because this motherfucker, your boy. No, that's your boy, Adam Pierce. Pierce is fucking he blocked trash. Me. <laughs> what top let's do a top. Run? Let's do a, a tag team match. Adam Pierce and Top Dollar versus the. Nah, because you be saluting Top Dollar too much. Y'all turn on your ass. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't trust this nigga, bro. This nigga, but my cut the shit going to Raw because Raw. You know, I was anticipating a good Raw pause. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it's hard. It's false. <laughs> I was <laughs> 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 okay, you didn't finish the goddamn sentence. I wouldn't, dog. No. I, I wouldn't. Like, you can't even talk. Like, the WWE <laughs> Raw. Was 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 very neat, and <laughs> I quit. Cut the shit. Anticipate the good raw is crazy. Oh my god, my bad. Woo. All right, what would you say? I said I quit. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> All right, flowers. All right, my flowers going to NXT, man, because they bringing out these new superstars. I don't know if y'all been watching, like, Next Up and shit. Mm. Got all these new females come on that shit, man, showing out. I just seen this one chick. She's this, this yeah. black chick. Yeah. yeah, so it's like whatever, like whatever's going on in the performance center and shit, they breeding these new superstars, and they preparing them, and I like it. I like it. A, they ain't going to be at the performance center no more. Oh yeah, I'm hearing they leave. They leaving. They're going to Vegas, ain't they? Yeah. Well, it's still gonna be a performance center. Just moving to Vegas. Be in here. Yeah, Even better, nigga. Getting closer, man. <laughs> oh yeah, no, uh, I forgot, nigga. Dudes, they um, they going on tour. Well, they not tour, but they going on uh, the road in XC. Yeah. So they go start hitting different cities now. They not just here. go stay. Yeah, I'm they, going. When they go to the Kingdom definitely form, going. Or or the into it. I'll be into it. They probably gonna go to. Uh, Kia for him? Nah, Anaheim. Uh, I know. I told you. Nah, Kia. Nah, they it's, Kia. Small. it's a small group. Kia small? They could do um into it. They could do staple. They did staple. No the pay per view. Well, man, they could go down there, but I want to go to Kia. But no, 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 it won't be staple because I I take that back. They did staple only because WrestleMania was like because niggas was gonna go yeah, there anyway. Kia. Yeah, close. Hey, it's down the street, nigga. Or the new um the new one. Into it. I don't think they want to pay that rent. Though. Into it. Is that what's going on? Into it. They want into it need people because yeah. nigga, they ain't got Paul George. The Clippers ain't so <laughs> Anywhere that's close to that, that, yeah. that, that, um. I'll take it on. Nigga, that ain't close. Cool with me, though. I'm trying to go close where, nigga, I can get an Uber. Yeah. And, and then go to Chili's. Yeah. And then um, see Jakari there. Hell yeah. For the sucker. Eating the egg roll. At Chili's? Yeah. They got air growth? Yeah. <laughs> you gonna pay for it? Shit, yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> Fire? Yeah. Shout out to Jakari. Shout out to Jakari, baby. You know what it is. Cool. Um, my flowers are going to two. I'm gonna have two flowers because you always get like a lot yeah, of flowers. Yeah, he, he, he get the bouquet. <laughs> my, my first flower is going to Bianca and EO because that was a good match. Boom. I want to see them. Now I want to see best of five with them. Boom. And then. My second one is going to, and we argued this last week for the longest, shout out to Ethan Page. Boom. Because that promo that he did against Trick Williams was funny as hell. When he, yeah. was like, <laughs> when he was acting like Booger T. Oh, my God. Yeah. So uh, some people will say he not getting used, but the crazy thing is he a champion. He came out and he. That's not what I said. 
I just said people. I'm not saying who yeah, said it. I'm, I'm, saying I'm standing on business, nigga. I know what I'm <laughs> talking about. People nigga. saying that he ain't getting used. I ain't say he wasn't getting used. He ain't a good champion. He not entertaining. I ain't say none of that. You said he trash. He used better. I said no. He just getting. Used. I just saying people. You saying yeah, you bring yeah, I'm just up. telling you what I'm just telling you what I said because I know I'm one of the people that you insinuate. He said people. Was, he said he was eating dogs and cats and all kind of dumb shit. Like I. Hey, bro, stop talking about Trump. Bro. <laughs> I like, just said what, what people say. I can't wait. I'm saying what people say. I can't wait till you deport your black ass. Good. Is the rent cheap somewhere else? Send your ass back to Hawthorne. Look, <laughs> 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 oh, your flowers going to. Uh, my flowers. <laughs> this nigga just jumped the line. Okay. No, nah, I gave my flowers already. He gave his flowers. Oh. Oh, yeah, he did. NXT. Uh, my flowers is going to Dale. What I do? Dale returned to the stage after like ten years. Eight. I mean, that's a big. Difference. My cut the shit is going to Dale. <laughs> 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 nah, I'm Eight. My flowers is going to Dale. Um, he hit the stage after after eight years. Um, he actually brought some people out. Like Mooski came. Some people were supposed to come, hit my phone, told me they couldn't make it in the last yeah. minute. And he I, had family, I had family there, too. Yeah, I wish somebody would hit my phone even last minute. I would have came, but go ahead. Yeah. Hit your phone last minute. <laughs> uh, he, he actually went up twice. He actually went up twice. I got a clip. Uh, I got to edit it and post it. <laughs> <laughs> but, but... I know that it's been a long time since you've been on stage, and I know that you know you've been hesitating or whatever, and it's only gonna get better from there. But keep up the good work, my nigga. All right, thank you, brother. And yeah. I'll be at the next Thursday one. I was already in my calendar. Do I need to remind you on Wednesday? <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. yeah I mean, all right, I I remind you on Wednesday. When is the next one? Not the Thursday. Same spot. Yeah. Oh, I might. I might yeah. I might go up too. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He should. I might go up too. Hey, I want the nigga to go up, man. Put it in the comments. Hell yeah, or hell I think no. We should meet. We should meet here and go to Uber. I'm always trying to. I don't want to drive. You <laughs> well, drove? Yeah. Yeah. How, where is it at? It's a Pico, nigga, it's right? Far. <laughs> yeah, like fuck <laughs> that. We left there and went to the dive bar. That's yeah. a routine. After that, we're going over there to bang, <laughs> bang, bang, and do all that shit. Oh yeah, dude, I got to drive there. Yeah, that's more money. Yeah. yeah. Got a big bitch with ass and titties. Oh, this gonna be my first time going to the dive bar. Yeah. Do I get VIP? We could make it happen. I'm gonna call them before. No. Since Avantia Smith pulling up. Don't do that. I need bitches. They gonna say, who the fuck are you? <laughs> now I'm gonna send my profile. I just hit we a million, pull, bitch. <laughs> bitch. For real? <laughs> Nigga, they invited to a pool party and everything. I can't swim. That shit gonna be dunking. We ain't go. No. <laughs> yeah, y'all need to start doing shit more on Thursdays. Yeah. That's the day I'm off. Yeah. Well, I'll yeah. let you know. It's going down. Thursday it is, shit. But yeah, that's my flowers. My flowers going to this nigga. Uh, my flowers also going to. I hope. Oh, this is the end of the show, so I can say it. My flowers going to the camera for not overheating this. Oh yeah, good job. <laughs> good job. Shout out to you. Then um, it'll go. Pew. Yeah. <laughs> you know, four K. I hope so. Oh, no, I, <laughs> I updated some equipment too, so it might be some. We under construction, but nigga, shit moving. <laughs> And my other flowers is going to Levante because this nigga been editing these videos even when he's sleepy and shit like that. And, bro, shout out to you. You, you be doing a fucking hell of a job. I don't know how the fuck you do what you do. My I sis. ain't got the energy. Man, for real. Or the <laughs> capability <laughs> of doing that shit. And then my other flowers is going to myself. See, another bouquet. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I did. But I saluted all three of us, so shut up. It's a bouquet, nigga shit. Um... I've been doing these music videos on the iPhone and we can continue to put out freestyles and shit like that. Mm-hmm. And I finally got out of being my spoiled rapper ass pause and becoming just an entertainer. And yeah. So I was waiting for a longer speech for yourself. I don't fuck with myself like that. <laughs> <laughs> That nigga said, shut the fuck up. <laughs> 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 Too late for that shit. <laughs> nah, but you know, some real shit. Some real shit. One thing is, 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 is this, is that I could talk a lot of stuff and I, and I be feeling like I have a lot of knowledge and I be passing a lot of knowledge on. The problem is when motherfuckers don't take it, I be pissed the fuck off. 
and I think they don't take it because they don't see me doing it. And That's what Diddy said. <laughs> this thing, how you interrupt my good speech with Diddy shit, bro? Because they don't hear take it. That's what they're <laughs> oh, sick. Uh, all right, y'all. We out of here before the camera cut off. Yeah. Right. You know I, what it is. I hate these niggas. Bye. <laughs> Peace. <laughs>